Hey, pretty little thing, it's Stas here. I am getting ready for a meeting and I'm going to take you guys along with me. <laughs> so first thing I'm gonna do is do my makeup. I'm going to start with clipping back my hair so it stays out of my face. And then the first thing I'm going to do is carve out my eyebrows so I can prep my eyelid with concealer and start on my eyeshadow. So I'm going to be using the PLT 17 concealer brush and the instant anti-age eraser from Maybelline. I have to use my <laughs> robe because my hands have so much moisturizer on them. So I'm just going to take it straight from here and just get it on my eyelid. And then I'm going to take my concealer brush and get really precise and carving out my brow bone. I like to put concealer as a base for my eyeshadow because I just feel like it makes it super even and just clean and ready for the eyeshadow to just sit on. So I just do that. And then I'll take my finger and just make sure it's super smooth. And then I'm gonna go in with the Morphe translucent powder with just a big fluffy brush. This is the PLT 07 brush. And I'm gonna put a little in the cap and just set the concealer. Okay, so now that we have a nice clean base for the eyeshadow, I'm going to be taking the Morphe 35X Big Primpin palette. I'm going to be using the shade Vanity Hour. It's like a orangey, bronzy color. And I'm just gonna be using that in my crease with the same brush that I used uh, the translucent powder with. And I'm just going to start putting that in my crease and making sure it's super blended out. My jacket does not look cute in the background. Okay, now that I'm done blending that out, I'm going to be taking the shade Going Somewhere. It's just like a little bit of a deeper shade. And I'm gonna be focusing that just on the end of my eye. I'm gonna be doing a super light, simple eyeshadow today. It's just what I'm feeling. And I'm gonna drag that like along my lash line and just in the outer crease. Then I'm going to take the shade, hmm, do I want make it pop or prep work? I'm gonna take the shade prep work with the PLT 11 little skinny brush. And I'm just gonna pack it on that brush and pop it in my inner corner for an inner corner highlight. I may go back in the palette with like a glitter color over my lid, but I'm gonna switch onto my face now. I'm going to be using the PLT Glow Drops on my skin before I do my foundation. And take them and put it a little everywhere. And rub it in. Then I'm gonna take the L'Oreal True Match Super Blendable Foundation. I have two colors, so I'm gonna see which one matches me best right now. That one looks pretty good to me. So I'm gonna use the shade Natural. I'm just gonna put like a few pumps on the back of my hands. And then I'm gonna be taking this big PLT 02 brush and I'm just going to put it on and buff it into my skin. And I'm just gonna do a super natural layer. Make sure you bring it down your neck. This foundation brush is like really nice. It's making my skin just look super smooth. And now I'm going to go back in with the same concealer and conceal my under eye. And I'm gonna put a little on my forehead, down my nose, on my smile lines, and a little on my chin. And I'm going to be taking the PLT 20 little brush and I'm just gonna go in with this and just pack it where I have the concealer and then I'll probably go back in with a big foundation brush to like really blend it. And I like to make sure the concealer kind of stays in a straight line like Sorry right, guys, my camera died. So basically what I was saying is I like to make sure my concealer blends upward to like give that lifting effect. So I'm now doing the other side making sure it's super packed in there and then blend out with the concealer brush any harsh i mean the foundation brush any lines okay once that's all blended out i'm going to go back in with the morphe translucent powder and i'm just going to lightly set my face 
with the PLT 03 brush. Make sure I set everywhere concealed so that doesn't move or anything and it stays all nice and highlighted. And don't forget your neck. Okay, then I'm gonna go in with the L'Oreal Bronze to Paradise and the PLT 19 brush and add some color back into this face. Bronze my forehead and jaw. I also want to try this bronzer. It is the Physicians Formula Matte Butter Bronzer. Just layer it on there. It smells really good. Then I'm going to take the PLT 10 brush. It's just like a small fluffy brush and I'm going to dip in the bronzer and just contour my nose a little. I don't really know how to contour my nose. I kind of just go down the sides and then hit the tip and then try and make that little line so it looks a little buttony and cute. Then blush, which is my favorite step. This is the Blush of Paradise by L'Oreal and I'm going to be using the PLT 06 brush. I'm just gonna pack a bunch of this blush on. It has like a little bit of a shimmer in it, so I'm keeping it like higher on my cheeks. Super pretty. And then sometimes I'll do a little on my nose. Now I'm going to try and wipe off a little bit of the shimmer color that I put in my inner corner. So I wanna smoke out my bottom lash line a little bit. I'm just gonna go in with the same shade that I put on my crease, the Vanity Hour. And I'm just gonna bring it down a little so I have something to connect to the top. And then I'm going to go back in with the prep work color and make sure my inner corner is all highlighted. And then I'm going to take a little bit of the Make It Pop and just highlight my nose a little. And take the PLT05 brush and get a little of the Make It Pop and just add a little bit on my cheekbones. I love to bake my cheekbones, so I'm just going to put translucent powder and then i'm going to grab the plt04 brush it has like a slight angle and i'm just going to pack it the brush with a lot of powder and just lightly bake so while i'm lightly baking i'm going to go in with my maybelline lash sensational mascara and i'm just going to coat my lashes okay now that the mascara is done i'm going to wipe off my bake next step is lips so i'm going to use the peaches and cream lip liner i think this is in shade borderline and i'm just going to line them lightly i think this might be my new favorite color okay now that lips are lined I'm going to put over the NYX Butter Gloss in the shade Praline. I'm just gonna do a little of this. This combo is so pretty. Okay, I think I'm done with my makeup. So I'm going to set my face with the Pretty Little Thing Glow Mist. Let it dry. Take the hair out. Okay, this is my final makeup look. I took my hair out. I think it's super pretty. It's kind of like giving me peachy tones, which I love. So I'm gonna get dressed because I have to leave soon and I'm gonna show you guys my outfit. Okay, this is my outfit. I'm wearing these baggy pants and then this cute little top. I'm obsessed with it. It's from PLT, obviously. So thank you guys so much for watching. It was so much fun taking over the Pretty Little Thing YouTube account. Comment down below if you guys want me to do another takeover soon. Final close up look. Again with the outfit, super cute, and I will see you guys soon.